The purpose of the NOAA P-3 aircrafts that fly into the hurricane are to collect data, especially what we call in situ data, which is data that is in the storm. We have instruments that are collecting information like pressure, temperature, relative humidity. Uh, but the other reason why we fly is that we're also interested in research. Uh, so we're collecting data that's going to improve the models. And one thing that's very unique about the P-3s that no other aircraft in the world has is the tail Doppler radar. We're taking a CAT scan of the storm and it's giving us information of how strong the convection is in the storm, how deep those uh, thunderstorms that collectively form the hurricane and how intense this hurricane is brewing out in the tropics. So that information is vital to our computer models that improve the track and forecasts of these storms. Once the National Hurricane Center receives this data, uh, what they do is that they compile it with all the rest of the data that they have, including the data that they get from computer models. In the past, computer models had coarse resolution, so they couldn't take advantage of the tail Doppler radar data that were, we were, was being sent. But nowadays, with finer computer models, faster running uh, CPUs, the data can be ingested and it can take a full breadth of all of the radar data and thereby painting a picture of how the hurricane's behaving. There's no other aircraft or any outfit out there that flies into storms that has this unique ability to collect radar information from the hurricane. Uh, the Air Force is also in the business of flying. They do reconnaissance missions, but they are not equipped with a tail Doppler radar like the P-3s are. So that is what makes us unique. That is what is vital to the computer models and helps us improve our understanding of the hurricane.